Hello again, people. <laughs> I have never been so disappointed with a newswire like uh, with this one. I guess I was just uh, too naive to believe Rockstar will have its redemption regarding Red Dead Online. I would have accepted even the later summer update, but we can be sure in one thing now. Red Dead Redemption saw its last update a year ago. And that's it. Us who truly love this game, will get endless loops of monthly information regarding bonuses and discounts until we finally get every single piece of clothes in the game. I honestly can't understand why developers still bring quality content to the game that's 9 years old, but not to the one much younger and superior in every aspect. I do play GTA Online too, it is good, but not Red Dead level good, you know? But uh, to sum up about summer update in Red Dead Online. Ain't gonna happen. And I've never wished I'd be proven wrong like I hope I will be about this right now. July is expected to be even more boring uh, than those months before for players above level 100 and maxed out roles at least. Since this uh, great game still attracts new players at least you guys will have something to do and have some fun. The month of July revolves around the earning potential of Call to Arms mode. It will dish out double experience and gold, so it will be worth your while if you want to pile up gold. I don't know for what, but if you want to, that is great option for you right now. Also, a month-long bonus is for those who play free realm missions, experience and dollars. So, the usual charity of dollars is doubled now. Great success! And if you have a Bounty Hunter license, you will get double experience. But not just regular experience, you will also have double roll experience. Like a flashback, a recent one. Great success! So, if you're now hooked on an experience train right now, clearing gang hideouts will result in tripled experience. Wow! But you know Rockstar won't disappoint, there's something else, don't worry about it just yet. Three times dollars payout on featured series. So, when you play one, you will be able to buy half of the Varmint rifle, when priced regularly of course, like in July. And a few more incredible opportunities, logging in any time this month will fill your loot box with 15 dynamite sticks and 3 graves and bolas. And players who surpass level 10 this month and those who did a couple of years ago will get 100 rounds of split point rifle ammo. And a 50 shell stuff incendiary buckshot shotgun ammo. That's actually great! Now, completing 5 roll challenges during any week uh, in this month will enrich your wardrobe with blue carbo double bandolier. And when we talk about gunsmith accessories, uh, rank unlocks on all holsters and offhand holsters are uh, removed in July. And a final monthly offer, or shall I say opportunity, is to win 3 rounds of a showdown and get an offer for 50% of any weapon. Great! There are also many discounts prepared for this month, although mostly of cosmetical nature. Roll outfits are reduced uh, by 25%, roll weapon variants by 40%, 30% on gas improved bow variants, gun belts, offhand holsters, and cell bags are down by 40%. All ammo is half priced. All multi class courses are reduced by 30%. They're cheaper, that's great. Fast travel camp upgrade is 40% cheaper and actually I'm looking forward to buy this one on my PS5 account. Heads are down by 30%, gloves by 40 And that's it. There's no returning limited time clothing, but there's a new community created outfit offered for free. Claim all components over at tailors and gunsmiths. And our weeklies are following, between July 5th and 11th, explosive series uh, which revolves around Call to Arms. Playing Call to Arms uh, gets you an offer for 50% of the Lamar revolver, while reaching 8th wave gets you Varmint Rifle for free. Between July 12th and 18th we'll have Hardcore Most Wanted series. Playing Call to Arms this week gets you an offer for 40% of any shotgun. And if you complete anything Blood Money related, it will fill your wardrobe with a red gardenia hat. Now, between 19th and 25th of July, again, call to arms, now with an offer for 30% of any weapon. And for those who play two free roam events, uh, we'll get blue charo jacket for male characters or blue bollard jacket for female characters. 
And in the last week of July until the 1st of August, you guessed it right, Call to Arms. Reward for free weapon component if we play Call to Arms. And if we play it with our persistent permanent posse, we will also get uh, red chaps. Red uh, Shaffer chaps, I think. That's it. Now let's see if Steam Summer Sale has a rebound game on sale. See you guys in the next video. Cheers!